Hi friends, this is Pastor Lucas Pin, and this is our snack for the journey. And we're starting another week, and we're still in the book of Second uh, First Chronicles. First, First Chronicles is a very important book because it gives us a lot of uh, 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 information uh, uh, about people, descendants, and all that the genealogies, and to connect the dots from all the way to Adam passing Abraham. David, and then in the New Testament, we're going to see the, the, the result, the final result, bringing the, the, the lineage, not only from Adam, Abraham, but from David to Jesus, showing that, yes, he is, uh, he, he can claim uh, the, the, the throne. So it's, it's a very important book, and, and it's interesting because sometimes the, those books, they are they give us some details when you're putting the names and the stories it's not just the chronology and the and, and the genealogy but it's it's give us the the a little bit details here and there that tells the story and it's a it's a very interesting book and and the, and the chronicles will focus in judah israel is gone now the the main focus here is the king kingdom of the south judah Today I'm going to share with you a very interesting verse, but I, before I go there, please uh, subscribe to our channel, share this video with your friends and families, and help us to bless other people. This is just a snack for your spiritual journey. So let, let's let's get there. The first uh, verse for, to, for this week is in the chapter 6, verse 31, 631. This is what the, the text says. These are the men David put in charge of the music in the house of the Lord after the ark came to rest there. And then he's going to put a list of people. And it's, it seems here on the other test that we're going to see, and we saw last week uh, another uh, other test about, text about that, is the, the importance of the music in the sanctuary, in the temple. In the case of David, it was in the temple because he didn't. He was planning to build the temple and he was not able to do it. Solomon did, and Solomon continued the tradition to to have musicians there to sing, to praise the Lord, to glorify the Lord. This was their function, and they were very important. And and, and this is why it's very important for our lives. Music is very important for our lives to worship the Lord, to sing, to praise Him. But it is important for the church to have people to help us to worship the Lord. People who will lead the Lord. And these are people picked by David. And David was a musician. He was an author. All the, the majority of the Psalms in the Bible are from David. He understood the importance of music. Not only his personal life, but the life of people around him and the life of the people worshiping God. And he, he said, we, are, we need to have a group of people to worship the Lord, to lead the praise and worship, put in charge of the music in the house of the Lord. And, the, and here you're going to see a list of people. And sometimes the details, what they do, how they did, and how that works, and what they're supposed to do, it's giving us the importance of the music, not only in our life, in our spiritual life, but in the life of the church. And, and you need to, to, to make aware, and, and you need to make people aware of that, that they are important. People that are leading, people that are singing, uh, we, we, we thank them, we recognize them, because it is important for the life of the church. People that help us to worship the Lord. Guide us in singing. So it's not just us singing, it's they helping us to praise the Lord and worship Him. So they are important and we are thankful for their lives. And this is our snack for today. God bless you.